We're going to look at the wear use processing in the bill of material manager for a standard bill of material. Wear use processing is called fine component within the bill of material manager. And when I bring up this window, we get our options for our wear used capability. Uh, we first of all start with entering the component we want to search for. We can enter in an ST18 gauge and a wildcard, meaning find me all the bills of material that contain the components starting with ST18 gauge. Um, we're not limited to one component, however. We can enter in one or two or three or four or multiple uh, components to search for. And using the AND and OR logic, we can specify whether the parent bills of material that are returned need to contain all of the components that I entered or any one of the components that I entered. Uh, we can also, if we don't know the component uh, number, we can enter in description and we can use starts with or that contains. Uh, by default, the where used will not look at bills of material in a started or obsolete status. But just simply by checking these particular status boxes, we can include obsolete and started items. In addition, we can say only look within parent items, so bills of material, that uh, are of a particular product class and we can select one or multiples of these product classes. Likewise we can enter into the different group codes to search for and again these are tied to your parent items. Finally I want to talk about the difference between immediate and full. We're going to start by processing this with an immediate and I'm going to go out here and process my search. And what's returned basically is what Made to Manage would return, is the parts that have the uh, bills of material that contain this particular component that I was searching for. And here we see that it, it's contained in two different parent items, uh, the CP2090 and the CS2330. Um, and that's nice and that, that works pretty good, but again, that's a sim similar functionality that you have within Made to Manage. But just coming down here and selecting this from immediate to full and then reprocessing that search, it will go out and actually do a full parent to child or child to parent search where you search. So it'll show me not only where those components are used, but there where those components are used and where those components are used. What we see now are the full search of all of the components out there or all of the parts out there that use the ST18 gauge steel somewhere within their product structure. So when we see at the top we see that the ST18 gauge uh, is used in the CP2090 which we saw under the immediate processing but then down here we see that the ST the steel was also used in the CP2090 which was used in the 20, uh, 2004B and going down a little bit further we see that steel was used in the 2090 this 2004B which is used in the FF202W so what we're seeing is a full uh, hierarchy of exactly where these components are used within your product structure. Clicking the number one brings you down a list, a real clean, nice, neat list of all of the components that use that steel somewhere within its product structure.